crazy son of a bitch Jervis Tetch just walked into the precinct and handed himself in. He says he's taken hostages, wants to talk to you. I'm on my way. Don't let anyone speak to him until I get there. You hear about that body we found? I tell you, that ain't no regular murder. Seeing the body messed up like that, I'm sickening. At least we got Ivy locked up. Last thing we need is her out there working her magic. The others might not say it, but thanks. We couldn't do this alone. What's the lead on that fire crew? We know where one of them is, right? At least we got Ivy locked up. Last thing we need is her out there working her magic. I thought things are bad enough with Scarecrow to deal with. Now there's an army out there on the streets. Gotham's being invaded? I'm saying the words and I still can't believe it. This battle's hard enough without our own team switching sides. These guys think they can run with the devil and not get burned? They're crazy. Anything I can do to help find the Commissioner's daughter, you just let me know. Something interesting cropped up about the militia. They've all worked for private contractors. They're guns for hire, mercenaries. These people have no code. They work for the highest bidder. Looks like Scarecrow had the money. Gordon was never happy about her living in the city, especially after what happened with you-know-who. I guess he was right. Man, that kid's had some bad luck. It's like she's got a black cloud following her around. What the hell was she doing in the city anyway? I know, seems weird. What did she think she was up to? Maybe she thought she could help. She's supposed to be pretty smart. Clearly not smart enough. So Gordon finds his kid, then what? They're just gonna apologize and hand it back? I don't think so. Can't hide in here all night. This nightmare isn't gonna end for you, ever. What is this, a fashion show? You think a new suit's gonna help? <laughs> You're a bigger fool than I thought. The Arkham Knight trained us, Batman. We know your every move. What is this, a fashion show? You think a new suit's gonna help? <laughs> You're a bigger fool than I thought. You'll find the firefighters, Batman, don't worry. Oh, they'll be dead, but you'll find them. Hurry up, Bat. One of them flame heads is probably biting the dust as we speak. He's looking better, don't you think? He stopped screaming, at least. Hey, Owens, you okay? Come on, buddy, say something. Stuck in there on his own can't be helping. It's just making him more paranoid. I think you might be freaking him out, Batman. You look scary enough without fear toxin. April 11, October 19th. Going back over some old interviews I did on Gotham's homeless. Numbers were dropping. No one knew why. I think there might have been a link to Blackfire. My name's Terry Noonan. I've worked the sewers best part of 20 years. You name it, I've seen it. Walls of fat so thick they'd swallow you up. Rats as big as dogs. Enough teeth and hair to give you nightmares. It's a different world down there. I understand you've got a theory, Mr. Noonan. 
Terry, please. Some people like to think the homeless are disappearing because Gotham's pulling them out of the gutter. But you think different? I've heard things. Strange things. Voices. Chanting. Chanting? Like church. It's been like this for months. I hear it more often, and it's getting louder. Have you ever tried to find it? Hey, I ain't stupid. Besides, none of my business. If you were smart, you'd think the same. Noonan went missing not long after this. Cops found his body stuffed in one of those giant fat deposits. They said it was an accident. I figure he found something he wasn't supposed to. What the hell are you up to, Blackfire? I'm watching you, Ryder. What? Not interesting enough for you out there, Batman? You should stick with old Jack. He knows where to find the action. You're taking up valuable space. None of the blockheads in blue out there have a clue what they're up to. They think a homicide is something you use on weeds. Whatever you're doing, drop it. You know, I live for these conversations. Tape 11, October 19th. Going back over some old interviews I did on Gotham. Sources on the mainland are saying they're playing down the threat, saying the explosion at Ace was an accident. Guess they're trying to stop panic spreading. Good job I'm here to tell the truth. I want this sewage best Scarecrow snatches Gordon's kid? I'm trying to figure out the angle here. Something doesn't add up. I don't think Cash likes me very much. Last time we spoke, he was sharpening his hook. It's a different world down there. I understand you've got a theory, Mr. Nuna. Terry, please. Some people like to think the homeless are disappearing because Gotham's pulling them out of the gutter. But you think different? I've heard things. Strange things. Voices. Chanting. Chanting? Like church. New suit? It's been I like thought so. I noticed I these things. Often, and it's getting louder. Have you ever tried to find it? Hey, if you want my opinion, it was in the public interest to know about the overweight chihuahua. Man, that was a slow news day. Sources on the mainland are saying they're playing down the threat, saying the explosion at Ace was an accident. There's blood everywhere on my hand. Cash thinks I'm going in there. He's crazy. He's doing just fine with us out here. He's still hallucinating. He's too dangerous. The face is. What's wrong with him? The monster's with you. He's right there. Can't you see him? If you ask me, we should be taking our boys off the streets. No way we can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with a damn army. Those workers from Ace are gonna be okay, Batman. Shame not all of them made it. If you ask me, we should be taking our boys off the streets. No way we can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with a damn army. None of us is safe here. We're all gonna die! 